one of the best ways to experience Old New Orleans and the mighty Mississippi. A jazz cruise aboard an old-fashioned paddle wheel riverboat. And launching this month, the first new riverboat to surface since Hurricane Katrina collapsed the city's tourism industry more than a decade ago. Back in Orland Steamboat Company managed to keep afloat the Natchez, one of the nation's last commercially operated paddle wheel steamboats. At one point in time, there were thousands going up and down the rivers and the lakes of this wonderful country here. So there's only six, and we've got one of them. So we love showcasing that engine room. The new vessel, called the City of New Orleans, won't be steam powered, but will offer an authentic paddle wheel experience. At the back of the second deck, there's a little walk around where people can go out and they can look down on the paddle wheel and they can see it working. Tours will include narration about the history of the city and sights along the shoreline. You can see the beautiful French Quarter, you got your cameras out. It was a great trip, a little bit of history along the river and just a fun ride. Officials say they don't expect a shortage of passengers. The number of visitors to New Orleans has surpassed pre-Katrina levels in recent years, and the riverboats are a big draw. People don't come here only for food and music. What they like is other experiences. They love to do things like go on swamp tours. They love to go on the paddle wheelers. People stand in lines to go see them because that, that experience on a paddle wheeler is just one of the great added attractions of imagining yourself in a time gone by. The new vessel, originally a casino boat built in 1991, already looked the part of a New Orleans riverboat. But the interior had to be gutted to make way for a commercial galley, seating for hundreds of brunch and dinner guests, live bands, and dancing. The boat is expected to be ready for tours by January 21st. And in another year, overnight river cruises may be back in New Orleans with the return of the Delta Queen, the nation's last authentic overnight steamboat. After repairs, it's expected to return to service in 2020. Stacy Plaisance, The Associated Press, New Orleans.